Okay. Okay. So this is A major, the flesh scales, scale on one string. So when you practice, the first thing I would do would be to play it in first position just to get the pitches in your ear. So go ahead and use open. the first part. Then let's talk about these guide tones. So guide tones, you shift on the last finger you play before the shift, okay? So that would mean I would play A, B, C sharp, D. Now I want to go from D third finger to one on E. So my last finger before the shift is D, it's third finger. So if one is on E, F sharp, G sharp, my three has to go up to G sharp. So if I'm not sure what that sounds like, I'm going to practice that. And you can practice it your three ways, right? So like, slow. Is it like the um, shifting exercises that we used to do? Yep. Okay. Do that ten times, then do... Ten times, then... And then when you put it in there, you'll fit it into the rhythm. So it would be like this. Okay? Oh. Does that make sense? Yeah. So now without guide, guide tone, so we still think of that and we still move our hand that way, but without hearing the actual pitch, we would play. Okay? Then we come to arpeggios. So again, I would practice one arpeggio at a time to really understand it. So first play it in first position. from first position up to fourth. Our last finger is two, so F. And for the guide tones, you don't have to beat match the key signature if it's easier to hear a perfect fourth, but you do that. So then coming down, four, one. So my guide tone is going to be one. So I'm going to shift down to first position, which will be B. So, so putting that together. Okay, then doing that without the guide tone, without hearing the pitch. Okay, you can also sing. Or if it's too high, or octave lower, so A, C, E. a bunch of times so you feel very confident, okay? So next arpeggio, let's play it, actually I'll just play this exercise now, okay? So I'll play it with the guide tone, so. B. Now let's do F sharp. B. G sharp. B, G, or you could do D, G sharp, other way, C sharp, this one I'd probably be easier with a G natural, C sharp, D, E, B, F sharp, okay, mm -hmm. and then without guide tones, it sounds like, make sure you 
don't squeeze your thumb, please. Or it'll get stuck. Nice light finger, too, when you're shifting. Broken thirds, it's the same finger shift, so there's no guide tone. So now we'll shift two two. Two two. Now an extension. Reach for C sharp. Same finger, three three. Same finger, two, two. Now chromatic, don't do guide tones, or right, all half steps. So now one, two, one, two, one, two, two, three, four, three, three, two. Two, one, three, two, one, three, two, one, open. Okay? Yeah. Thank you. Mm -hmm.